everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome my name is Arlene today I'm going to be reviewing this oil filled radiator let's go ahead and get right into this so when you open it up you'll have this user manual right here so let's go ahead and see how to install these so it says you do not want to operate this unless the wheels are attached so make sure you put on the wheels I do like the fact that right here it has this area where you can put the cord wind it up so that you don't have like a ton of extra cord okay so you're gonna unscrew the bolt off of this now you do want to make sure you do not have it plugged in while doing this so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna lay it like this I'm gonna loop this through like put it underneath this is the easiest way to do it loop it through right here and then push the other one through this side, hold it on with my fingers underneath, and then I'm gonna screw it on right here. As much as you can. And then we're gonna do the same thing to this side. You do wanna make sure that you put it on the furthest one on each side. We're gonna flip it back over. And you can hear all the oil falling down. Okay, so let me go ahead. I'm going to turn it on, which it's located this side. So you're going to do it on. So you have one, two, three different modes. Let's go ahead and turn it to max. You want to make sure that you have it away from, like far enough difference from walls and just make sure that nothing is around it because you don't want nothing to catch on fire. So it is 120 volts. The frequency is 60. The rate power is 1,200 watts. Power in is 500 watts. Power in setting two is 700. And total input power setting number three is 1,200. So I'm gonna let it set and see how warm it actually gets. So it is getting hot in my room. You can see, watch, you can see my hair moving. That's from the heat rising. You can feel it. It's getting really hot in here. Like I had this on because I was cold. I was just telling my husband I'm starting to get hot in here. So this is definitely heating up my room really well, especially around this area. It's probably the hottest over here. It's still um, warming up. It's been on for maybe 15 minutes now, so it hasn't even been on that long. Um, and I can already feel a difference in my room. Um, we'll definitely be using this this winter. Um, you do want to be careful because this thing gets extremely hot. So if you do have small children, you're not going to want to keep it anywhere that they can get near it because they will burn themselves because I can feel the heat coming off this. And it is pretty hot. Um, so definitely... If you do have small children, you're going to probably want to get like a baby gate or put something, um, make sure that it's not covered, but put something around it or keep it somewhere where they can't get to it because um, you could probably get some severe burns if your skin touches this. So that's just a warning um, because this does get very hot. We actually use one like this at our church and we actually put like, some fencing like some metal fencing around it to where nobody will run into it and actually get burnt but yeah that completes this video thank you so much for watching bye god bless